the XP source code light leak. A lot of people have been asking me about it, and I have not looked at it. I know you're like, yeah, sure you have it, man. But no, I really haven't because I did sign an NDA, and I really don't want to taint myself. I was really curious. I did want to see Task Manager. So I think I can say this. Uh, hang on. Let me be sure. Yeah, I think so. So when I wanted to do an episode on Task Manager, I thought this would be way more interesting if I can actually show the code and talk about the code and show how it's laid out and so forth. But I can't just take this leaked source code and put it on the web because even though it's already on the web, my NDA probably prevents that. I and mean, if it doesn't, it's not in good taste to do that, right? Um, I don't think I would do that even if I didn't have an NDA because it's not ethical to leak source code, I don't think. But uh, that's a whole separate issue. You might think it's like heroic to leak, to leak source code. I have no idea. Um, point being, however, that for legal reasons, I didn't want to touch the leak source code. So what I did is I wrote to Microsoft and I said, uh, hey, this is what I'd like to do. And I asked them. And the first one came back from legal and they said, we don't give legal advice, meaning, yeah, you can try it and see what happens. But so I wasn't going to do that. So then I wrote to HR and I said, based on, I don't want legal advice, but based on the stuff I signed with HR, um, can I do this? And so what they did is they got the guys from Windows involved and the guys from Windows involved were like, yeah, have at it. And they actually zipped it up and sent it to me. So it was like a three minute conversation on the phone and they emailed it to me. So. That was super handy, and that gave me all the source code of task manager that I had not seen in forever. And that was really the code I wanted to see badly. So there's nothing else that I need to see in NT or XP very badly, so I haven't looked at the source code leak. I think it's kind of interesting that somebody, I think, has actually got the thing to compile, which was not that easy if you worked there. To build the whole, well, I should say, you know, the hardware is a little better today. Um, it probably builds in like an hour now or something, whereas it took a day in those times. But uh, even getting it to do so with internal knowledge was not easy. So I think it's pretty impressive that somebody got the thing to compile and work um, from a leak. 